So Stars and Stripes RC here with a quick, easy, cheap way to make wing bags. I got this uh, Reflectix insulation at Lowe's 25 feet for $25. And I've never made these before, uh, but transporting the wings to the field when you have multiple planes in the car, you know all about hangar rash and uh, for the foam planes and then for the ARF planes covered in monocoat or ultra coat, it can easily get damaged in transport. So I made a couple of wing bags for my Arrows Husky uh, with a little compartment for my spar here. Um, also, I made a couple for my 1700 millimeter Corsair. Um, went together really well. I uh, have my compartment here for my spars and uh, any accessories, I guess, that I want to put in there. So what I'm making for uh, is my Phoenix Models. Dolphin Sport 40, as you can see, it's a one piece, it's two piece, but it's together. And so I'm basically making two bags, one for each half, as you'll see later. But I made one already right here. And I've already made my measurements here. So I'll put this one together and I'll show you how my thinking on, uh, the wing bag for instead of making one long bag I'm doing a two-piece thing so um, this stuff is really easy to work with and it doesn't take a lot of time and again it's cheap versus spending a lot of money on wing bags and it will be very protective. Uh, so, I have several more planes that I'm going to be making them for. wing bags are nice uh, some of them you can get two wings in one bag but uh, they're they're more expensive and you can you can always add carry handles to your wing bags, making them out of this material as well. So, the different things you can do, just let your imagination go wild, you know? <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and take my, my edges where I'm gonna have the opening first it's easier to do versus doing it after you tape all the sides together This one is 
is actually very simple compared to the one I made for the Corsair. The Corsair obviously is a, a, a wider wing at the fuselage side and it tapers. So I made those to conform with the wing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take scotch tape and I'm going to take this edges in place so that when I start putting the duct tape on it doesn't doesn't move around on me. I'll just take it in at the top and at the bottom. I've always heard people talk about this material and, and making wing bags out of it. I've been flying for 20 years. I've never had a wing bag and decided to try it out. doesn't have to be pretty. I'm going to add some more to it over the final edges that'll make it a little a little straighter. Now measure these wider, you have to take into consideration that the wings have servos on them. If they're not flush mounted servos, you want to make it a little wider so that uh, it opens enough so that you don't have a hard time with the, with the servos snagging up on the bag on the inside. So I'll take another and, and reinforcement. Keep that stuff on the edges from coming off. Put one piece across the bottom.
so that's pretty much it, really. Pretty basic wing bag. You can make them for any wing. Test it out. take a little bit of tape and the reason I wanted to make a two-piece wing bag for this is because of the dihedral in the wing and just to keep it together So, very easy, quick, cheap, very, it works very well, it'll protect that wing from getting punctured on transport. So, there you have it, Stars and Straps RC, thanks for watching.